Greetings, Raiders and Antagonists. Raiders of the Broken Planet become Space Lords on August 23rd. On the same day, the fourth campaign, Council Apocalypse, launches, and the game becomes 100% free to play. Since its launch last September, Raiders of the Broken Planet has evolved to become what you, the players, wanted it to be. Thus, now it's the perfect time to go over our top 10 essential changes that are happening to the game. Space Lords includes four full campaigns, the complete first Broken Planet Grand Adventure, totally for free. In the months that have passed since last September, we have launched an avalanche of new content. 17 huge missions, 66 weapons, 17 playable characters, over 700 character cards, 22 incredible skins, over 80 cinematic scenes that tell an epic story. And that's only the beginning. A new progression system in which players access new missions, characters, weapons and cards. There is not a single moment without reward. New mission grid, which includes several novelties. Now antagonists can choose missions too. Some missions include special rewards that are renewed every few hours. New cinema mode, where you can watch all the cinematic scenes at your own pace. New weapon forge system to craft and improve your weapons by assigning them points individual rewards proportional to your performance in the game. New tutorial videos to learn the game mechanics easily. New mentor matches with extra rewards for veteran raiders who guide new players through their first missions. New contextual hint system. New real-time feedback system to teach players how to use the melee combat effectively. Always evolving matchmaking system, now more efficient matching players and pitting them against antagonists with a similar MMR. Crossplay between consoles and PC, essential to keep the whole Space Lords community united. And Mercury Steam's unbreakable commitment to give you the Space Lords universe past, present and future completely for free. We hope you like all this new content that will arrive to the game on August 23rd and, as always, see you on the Broken Planet.